In a New York City apartment building, how long does a landlord have to fix something? We depose a lot of landlords, a lot of management companies that answer our lawsuits through their counsel for various types of accidents and uh, serious injuries. And what we find is that we get a, a very wide a very wide variety of answers from the landlords and from the management companies that are responsible for taking care of these properties. And if somebody calls their landlord and says, hey, I have, let's say, a problem in my apartment, I have a, a, a broken piece of tile, or I have a defective uh, light switch, please come and please fix it. And sometimes people will have to wait like a week, two weeks, or longer than that for the landlord to fix it. And there's no magical time limit where the landlord has to fix it in like one day or two days. But the tenants have certain things that they can do. For example, they can call 311, they can complain to the building department, they can complain to the city of New York who will send out an inspector and then the landlord and management company may get, a, may get a fine because of that, or they get a write-up on uh, the New York City Department of uh, Housing and Preservation for having a violation. So there's certain things that the tenants can do. But the most important thing, of course, is for the landlord to fix whatever the issue is before someone gets hurt. Because once someone gets hurt, then everything changes. Now the... Uh, tenant has uh, also become a personal injury plaintiff and they have to incur medical costs, they have to get medical care, they could hire a lawyer and file a lawsuit against the landlord. So a lot of issues come into play. But according to the jury instructions that are given to the jury at the uh, trials of such personal injury cases, the landlord has to use what is known as reasonable care, ordinary care, that level of care that an ordinarily or reasonable person would use. So the landlord doesn't have any type of uh, statutory duty to take care of something, let's say, in a, in, a, in a week or in two weeks or in a day, but they just have to be reasonable. So if something is not reasonable, if someone is complaining, let's say, every day and a week goes by, two weeks go by, that, that it should have been fixed, that it's not fixed, then the tenant, I, I think, would have a good case. So it all depends on that. Um, I hope this is helpful. And uh, feel free to ask us any questions about uh, being a tenant in uh, New York City apartment buildings.